So apparently I lost the footage of making my breakfast. I had a banana peanut butter smoothie with uh, two bananas, a bunch of soy milk, a big scoop of peanut butter, a tablespoon of linseeds or flax seeds and a little bit of uh, syrup. And it's seriously one of my favorite smoothies and I have it all the time. So now we're going to go to lunch. I'm making chips inspired by high carb uh, Hannah's recipe from a couple of weeks ago. I start off by rinsing the potatoes, cutting them into small chips and I rinse them very thoroughly and then I lay them on a paper towel and I dry them off. Then I add some salt, paprika powder, cayenne pepper and some curry powder and I stir really well. I bake them in the air fryer. And every five minutes I toss them around until they are done. And that is it, it's really an easy recipe. So here I have my chips or my crisps. And I have uh, some spaghetti cooking right now, I'm gonna mix it with some tomato paste and um, defrosted frozen spinach and defrosted frozen peas and that will be the rest of my lunch because this is a pretty big snack to be honest um, but it's not going to fill me up for lunch I just got a call that I do have to go to work tonight so um, I'm going to have an earlier dinner some of them look, look a bit burned and other aren't fully um, crisp yet but I don't mind I really like this well, I made this earlier last week and now I made this last week not earlier this week so yeah that's going to be my lunch and I'll see you for my early dinner I'm making the same dish as I did in last week's video oh well I am shredding carrots chopping up tofu then I'm cooking the tofu in some oil I cook up some spaghetti noodles add the carrots and stir a lot then I add the spaghetti noodles I stir some more and I use the same sauce that I made last week with peanut butter and Indian soy sauce so funny thing is that I made the exact same dinner as last time uh, but I changed it up a little bit I used different vegetables I only used carrots and tofu this time and didn't use any onion or uh, Brussels sprouts I don't know if I used onion last week funny thing is uh, I made this last week for the first time ever and I love it so much that this is probably the fifth time that I've made this now this week so, it is Tuesday now and uh, I filmed last week's video on last week's uh, Tuesday. So, I've in this dish five times in seven days. <laughs> so that is how much I love it. But it is the noodle dish, the Asian inspired noodle dish um, with a sort of a peanut sauce. So, I'm going to eat that now very, very slowly because I'm still not really hungry, but now that I smell this, I really want to eat, the, eat, eat it. Uh, I also made myself a cup of tea because it's been so freezing cold in this house. I don't know. I turn on the heater and then upstairs, usually my room is the first room to get warm, but uh, my heater was acting up or whatever. It didn't get warm at all. So I have had freezing hands the entire day. Um, but whatever, tonight I'll walk so much that I won't be cold at all. Uh, I work as a waitress by the way, so hence the walking. So I'm going to eat my, or drink my tea, eat my noodles, and this is probably all that I'll be having today. If I do eat something later tonight, when my boyfriend comes over, um, I'll film that, but I don't think there's... I don't think I'll be eating anything else. So um, I'm going to close off the video here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. I also always appreciate any comments. Um, if you have any questions about any things that I made, any recipes. 
um, please tell me. I'd also love for you to subscribe to this channel. Every Wednesday I'll post uh, vi any videos about vegan lifestyle recipes or rants or whatever. And every Saturday I post uh, videos like these, what I ate today videos. Uh, so if you like those, definitely subscribe to this channel. So yeah, I'll see you next time.